All right, so pretty much gonna do a quick weight in comparison with uh, this fabric saddle. As you can see, it's, um, it's already got the dimensions right here already and the spec weight, but I'm just gonna weigh it on my scale as well. I'm gonna basically be replacing this saddle. Uh, it's like a specialized Roman kind of design, I guess, but uh, it's full carbon. Took it on a ride, century ride, the other uh, past weekend, and pretty much hurt my butt. And the main thing was just my butt was hurting the whole time, and uh, it's hardly padded. It's pretty lightweight, but I'm gonna go for comfort because I had to take a break for a few days, and this came in and wanted to kind of weigh it out, and uh, you know, it kind of already shows the specs. So yeah, it's pretty much, uh, I don't expect it to be lightweight. Uh, it's a fabric saddle with the little um, like honeycomb uh, cells in there. It feels like hexagon shaped cells and then feels rubbery texture. I do have Brooks saddle and um, it looks like it's lighter. I don't have it with me, but and uh, it might be more comfy. It's pink, kind of matches the bike scheme that I'm doing. You know, I'm kind of like not really in the mood to find the right color, but they had it, so just why not, right? So yeah, I'm gonna try it out and uh, install it on my bike. Hopefully it improves my comfort. You know, there's just information about it. And that should be it. All right, so <clears throat> I got the seat installed. As you can see, it's pretty much uh, more, obviously much narrower, narrower, like a, kind of like a physique Arione. But um, either way, it's 155 versus I think 138 width or something like that. So I just did a quick saddle check and it uh, feels okay. Um, Still kind of hurting, so can't really tell if the comfort's gonna be there yet. And uh, pretty much, this is kind of how I kind of left the bike when I took it up there to the hills of Lake Tahoe. Uh, it's kind of got like a lot of things I need to take care of uh, at the moment. But um, pretty much, I carried all this stuff. The front's super heavy. Uh, I don't have a scale, but um, it's um. Pretty much, <laughs> pretty much weighs down the bike a lot. So, uh, the bike weighs about what 15, 16 pounds or so. Haven't weighed it actually, but uh, either way, it's um, all this stuff was probably like uh, just off the top of my head. It was probably it felt like about almost 10 pounds maybe on additional to the front. So I don't have a scale on me, but <clears throat> it's packed full of repair kit and everything and I did put it to use on some riders that had flat so I got a tubeless set up on it and uh, just a little review of the uh, setup uh, from my previous video the 4630 uh, it was okay uh, not the best but it's shift not as smooth but it was it did its job uh, helped me uh, get up to the top I think I might uh, the chain is new. The cassettes used. Uh, I might have to might have to replace the cassette soon. It's uh, not shifting or he's making a clunky noise. But other than that, yeah, the saddle. Uh, it's pretty much gonna be here to stay. So I'll probably get used to it. Uh, with the bike color kind of similar, I think it might be okay. If not, I can always switch it to another bike. All right.